Is the Google AI Essential Certificate actually worth it? That's right, Google just came out with an AI related course and when you complete it, you actually get a certificate. Now this is hosted on Coursera, link is in the description and the pinned comment down below if you wanna check it out. But in this video, we are gonna go over a thorough review of this certificate. All the way from an overview of the course itself, then we're gonna talk about things like the time to completion, the cost, the demand, the salary, the production value of the course, its chances of landing you a job, what value it offers, and we're gonna rank each of them on a scale from one to 10, with 10 being the best. And in the end, we will give you a final verdict and score. So if you appreciate me making this type of content, let me know by gently tapping that like button. And let's jump into it with the overview of the course. So this just came out, so it's kind of hot off the press. And they say that it only takes about three weeks to complete. Now I can tell you based on past experiences with Coursera and Google, that when they say it takes five to six months to complete, it usually means it only takes one or two. And so them saying it takes three weeks to complete probably means that you can complete it in a few days. <laughs> they also say that it's beginner level and it has a flexible schedule so you can learn at your own pace. Now this just came out and there's already over 20,000 wow. people that have been enrolled. By the time you see this, there may be many, many more. And this basically helps you to train in the basics of AI. So this might help you get an AI related job or integrate AI into your job that already exists so that you can make more money and get a raise. And the skills they say you're gonna gain are artificial intelligence, prompt engineering, large language models, and generative AI. Now there's five modules in the course. The first module is introduction to AI. The second module is maximize productivity with AI tools. The third module is called discover the art of prompt engineering. The fourth module is called use AI responsibly. Glad to see them doing that one. And the fifth module is stay ahead of the curve. Now that you have an overview of the course, let's talk about the time to completion. As I said before, they say that it's only gonna take about three weeks, which probably means you can finish it in a week or less. So this is something you could literally just finish if you have a break here and there, or if you just wanna take a weekend and go through the modules. And considering colleges take ah. over five years on average for you to get your bachelor's and most boot camps take somewhere between three months to a year, that is a really fast time frame. So when it comes to the time to completion, this one's a no brainer. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 score. Next, let's talk about the cost. Coursera costs about $49, and considering you could easily finish this in less than a month, it's gonna cost you about $49. And considering colleges cost over $100,000 on average, boot camps cost ten dollars to $30,000, that is a great price. So yeah, the cost is amazing, especially considering that if you sign up for Coursera, you can take a bunch of other yes. professional certificates that are also incredibly valuable. So when it comes to the cost, this one's a no-brainer. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Next, let's talk about the demand. Now, anything AI-related has an incredible amount of demand. Now, BLS doesn't say specifically AI-related jobs, but the closest thing is data scientist jobs, and they're growing at 35%. And just to put that in perspective, the average is about four to 6%. So they're growing seven to eight times faster than the average career. And AI is probably even hotter than data science. But data science or data related stuff like data analyst is a job that you would commonly go into if you were interested in AI. And if you type in a lot of AI related jobs on LinkedIn, then you sort by entry level, you're gonna see there are a ton of positions open. Now, one thing I will have to say, and this is why I'm gonna have to dock this one, I can't give it a 10 out of 10, is I don't think this certificate on its own is going to get you an AI related job. You're gonna have to supplement it with a really good portfolio and probably some outside studies, but it can really enhance your resume, your portfolio, your LinkedIn profile, and it can help you out a lot. So with that being said, the demand for AI is 10 out of 10, but for this certificate, I'm gonna go ahead and give it an eight out of 10. Next, let's talk about salary. So if you look up a lot of AI related jobs, such as data scientists, they make about 118 to $206,000 a year. Research scientists make 124 to $206,000 a year. Business intelligence analysts make 79 to $127,000 a year. And if you look at a lot of these AI related jobs, you can see that many of them make well over six figures. And there's a lot of people that have discussions on Reddit and talk about how much they're making. For instance, this guy makes 140K with an AI related job. So yeah, when it comes to the salary, this one absolutely destroys Destroys. I mean, this one without a doubt gets a 10 out of 10 score. Next, let's talk about the production value and engagement. So Google has been known to wow. do an amazing job with all of their professional certificates. For instance, their Google Data Analyst certificate got incredible feedback as well. So I would expect just about anything Google puts out to be top tier. But with that being said, this is brand new. Barely anybody's gone through it. And it currently has a 4.7 star rating, which is excellent. But for the production value, I can't really say anything yet. So I'm just gonna leave this one as a question mark out of 10. However, I may make a follow-up video and talk about it in more detail. Next, let's talk about its chances of landing you a job. 
this is where I do have to dock it a little bit. This certificate is not designed to land you a job on its own. If you use this certificate, it definitely will help you to land a job, but on its own, it's not going to do that. You're gonna to need to have a portfolio and you're going to need to do other supplementary studying. And this is a little bit different than some of the other Google and Coursera certificates, which in some cases they could actually land a job on their own. But with companies integrating AI into just about every facet of the business, this is gonna be something that looks amazing on your resume and amazing on your LinkedIn profile. And in many cases, recruiters will actually use this type of thing to search people up. That's right, they will actually search by the certificates that you have and they will discover you that way. So I'm a little bit torn here, but I think overall, just because of the track record of these and how good they've been, especially when you get them right when they come out, which by the way, they just came out. So this would be an amazing time to get it. I've seen again and again and again, people report that these did help them get a job. So with that being said, I think this one's a little bit less likely than some of the other ones, but I'm still going to give it a eight out of 10. Next, let's talk about the overall value that it offers. This is $49, guys. This is a $49 certificate. It looks amazing on your resume, looks amazing on your LinkedIn profile. People can find you through it. And it shows that you're somebody who is adapting to new things and you're constantly trying to get better. So this is a great way for you to help to get a job, for you to get a new job and move into a higher paying role or to get a raise in your current job. When you consider that just about any other type of education is gonna cost you bare minimum $10,000 and probably more like six figures if you get a college degree, and it's gonna cost you four years of your life, and it's gonna cost you a bunch of opportunity cost because you are going to college when you would have been making money if you just got a job. These certificates are a no brainer when it comes to the value. And another thing that's incredibly valuable about them is you can basically just audit a bunch of them and kind of get a really good idea of the types of skills that are actually in demand on the market right now. And if you were to you know, take this course, for instance, and you really don't like AI, well, great, you just saved yourself a bunch of time, effort, and money. And then you can move on to the data analytics course, or you can move on to the IT course, et cetera, et cetera. So yeah, the value here is a no brainer. It's a 10 out of 10. So the overall score is a 9.33 out of 10. I absolutely love this one. Love Coursera coming out with this. Love Google doing this. This is the cutting edge stuff. The reason that they release these certificates is they're basically trying to let the market know like, hey guys, we don't have enough people that have these skills. There's a supply and demand imbalance. So please learn these skills so that we can hire you. And especially when these certificates first come out, they can be incredibly valuable and they can give you a competitive advantage when it comes to getting a job. So yeah, I give this one two thumbs up. I'm actually incredibly excited about this one. And let me know guys, let me know if this actually helps you to land a job. I always love it when people comment. I've gotten tons of comments about the Google data analytics certificate and the Google IT certificate. So many people saying amazing things about it. And I want to know what you guys think about this one as well. By the way, I did make a video where I ranked the best and the worst Google and Coursera certificates from S tier, which is the best to F tier, which is the worst. And you can check that video out by clicking right here.